been quite the journey for Bandit before falling into Courtney Lee's care in Kelowna. The two-year-old German short-haired pointer was on death's doorstep in Edmonton. She was hit by a car about seven months ago. A couple from Cranbrook saw her limping along the side of the road. They were driving and I guess she was trying to run after her owner's truck because he was trying to leave her there. The Cranbrook couple found the owner. Because she has tattoos, they found him. And when they found him, he just, he wanted nothing to do with her. He was just like, you can have her, her leg's broken, she's no good to me kind of thing. So the Cranbrook couple put out an ad. Free to a loving home. I took her from there and brought her back here to fix her. But this is no easy fix. She has a compound fracture in her leg. When you look at the x-rays, you'll see that the bone is completely snapped in half and it's actually healed together kind of in the shape of an X, so she can't extend her leg. The options are either lose it or fix it. It'd be nice if she could keep her leg. The amputation will be a little bit cheaper, um, but the actual rebreaking and plating is when it gets quite expensive. But it's not cheap. I'm thinking anywhere between two and four grand. So Lee created a Facebook page. Among those offering to help, a 10-year-old Kelowna girl. Right away she went out and she started collecting bottles from her neighborhood with her siblings. And after the operation, Bandit will be adopted to another home. She'll make someone very happy. As for Lee, she says she's learned from the experience. I've just learned people here are really great. <laughs> I've, yeah, I've learned a lot about myself and how much someone can do. In Kelowna, Kelly Hayes, Castanet Media. Should be going for surgery in no time at this rate.